Why, hello there. Welcome back to Excalibur's Vanilla Adventures of Six Excalibur. Of course, you know who I am. And I am currently working on a storage solution because I am getting tired. Oh, ooh, you don't want to see my butt. Um, I am getting tired of having to um, move stuff around from here to there to there to here to here to there to there. You know, over and over and over again having to do all this junk. And uh, so what I've decided to do is, well, we're going to get rid of this chest because there's nothing in it. We're going to set up a stairway going up here. And I actually need it to be out a little bit. So I want it to be two, like so. And then this is going to be a two by two area here as soon as I get rid of this. And some of this here. Let's get our thelts and slabs, just like so. And get this 4x4 four four started. Alright. <clears throat> so, um, there's a lot of things that I've been wanting to do. And uh, uh, getting this spider spawner taken care of is one of those things. Let's see here. Is there anything here I can... Yeah, let's just get rid of this rose. I don't really need the rose. Um, the spider spawner is definitely one of those things that I need to get finished. Because the thing is going to give us a bunch of string and a lot of XP. And I really, really honestly want to get um, a lot of that taken care of. Now this is very nice goes down a door directly to the right and we can do this um, no we're not going to do that we're probably going to take some diorite or andesite yeah we're going to take some andesite this stuff here and bring it around and uh, we are going to have this raised up a little bit throughout here because we're going to have a spruce slab up there <coughs> So let's see here, we come in, we're going to want a torch there, and then it's a nice and nice and sunny here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to be putting this spiral staircase all the way up. And as you saw, it's one, two, three away from each side. So that's one, two, three, and stair, stair, and then we put in slab like a thou and then we are of course going to be removing this tray here because this is going to be getting in the way it was an experiment I was working on and I realized that um, it was not going to work well I mean it might as part of the flooring but we need the stairs so let's get this traded with that and let's get the stairs put in. And let's just make sure it goes two and then the third is that. So it's one, two, so right here. And this is the next floor. So we can actually do this and put in some nice slab flooring. Um, what I'm thinking about doing is each floor is going to be a separate type of uh, storage kind of solution so it's gonna be a different floor so we could put wood on this floor and wood based stuff we're going to be able to walk in here and see these chests here on the edge all the way to the wall and then stuff here as well and then we'll come up here and we will have our floor all in like so and that's one two three so here's our third floor again, where we do this, and let's go ahead and take that out. Uh, just out of range. So we, whoop, almost. 
Mm, there we go. My parkour skills really, 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 really suck. So, that's why you see me derp more often than I care to admit. So we come over here and then we take four more slab like so. One, two, three, four. We make sure that there's a light right here. And then we go ahead and put in our stairs. And as right here, we go three stairs up. Two and three. And we make sure that there is a light right here on the second stair. Boink, boink. And then this is going to get filled in. And we're going to fill it all the way in. So it's going to be eight total. So let's go down and make ourselves some more. All right. And yes, it's nighttime. I'm not worried. You shouldn't be either. There we go. And then we're going to do eight. One, two, three, four, seven, eight. And then swap these guys around. There we go. We can just do that. And then we put in our point. Yeah, you really, really enjoy watching me build stuff, don't you? Because, well, I am super awesome, it seems. There we go. And then we go one, two, three, four, five, and six. And then we can go ahead and kill this right there. And go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And look at that. We're up here and we can go up to our enchanting station. Um, if I continued the stairs up, we'd end up back here. And I really don't want to deal with that. Oh, we've got a lot of zombies and stuff out there. Anyway. So, we're going to leave it at that. Why don't we go ahead and get anything that's dropped. And we're going to come down here make a mad dash for the house get those zombies a burning boom and then we'll see where we're going from here um, <clears throat> well that was a good like half an hour <laughs> so here we go we've got our polished andesite I'm gonna go ahead and swap out these guys for a couple of Paused and site. We'll put this up here. And we'll put that dirt up in there. That's fine. I've been running around with a lot of this stuff on me. It's it's okay. We don't have to worry too much about it. Um, let's put the gold, the diamond, and the ender pearls in there. As you can see, I'm just randomly putting stuff in places, and I don't really like that. And we have all those pumpkins okay do to do 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 and we'll put these signs in here we don't need these signs on us and yeah, that should be okay where did I see the spider eyes there we are and I think that is good all right I don't really want to pay any attention to zombies and junk like that. So we'll go up here. What I was thinking about doing, as I said, and we're going to get rid of this right here and this because we already have the floor height already picked out. That's right there. So we'll come up here and we will make sure this floor is properly chopped. So we'll do this, and we can do this and that, and make sure that that is all in there. So we'll know that this is for um, all kinds, I don't have any chess here. this is going to be for all kinds of uh, wood products, and we're going to make sure that it 
covers where it needs to cover. I think it can cover all the way to here without any ill effect on us climbing up and down the stairs. Yep, and right here I wanted to put an andesite pillar. Yeah, and then we'll have a regular oak right there. So we can have some nice stuff here. And I want to frame all doors with andesite like this. Yeah, that's going to kill the door, I know. Trying to do some consistency stuff, you know, make it look nice anyway. And I think I'm going to go with, even though I don't like having Enderman in here, uh, I'm going to go with uh, three height ceilings where I can. Maybe I can just do this and fake it. I don't like that there. We can put it there, however, and mine that out. There we go. Don't mind me. <laughs> Uh, well, this is going to be a place where we're going to have some storage chests. We'll just move them right over here out of the way. And we'll have some full full block up there. Um, so this can be a full oak block here. And I'm going to do this andesite pillar between each floor. Now if we bring this down, we put a full cobblestone here to match that for now. And then we go bing, 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 cobblestone, and bing, 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 cobblestone. Now I'm putting the cobblestone there for now because uh, it looks like we are going to be using cobblestone for some things here and there and we're gonna have floor underneath that so we're gonna have slab that goes all the way over and everything and we're gonna make that look a little bit better um, I'm not really keen on towers but uh, I may as well build them the best I can you know what I mean so we're gonna go ahead and pull out this stuff here we're gonna have full um, blocks up there and we have to go all the way back here if you can see why and let's yep I know I just don't like leaving stuff laying around like that and we'll go up and fix that here. there we go so that was just two slabs there we go Slabby slabby. And we are also going to use our timepiece to take out this stuff. Because this should all be slabby as well. Alright. We can make some. That's no problem. And we are just using cobblestone slab for now. There's that, and one, two, right there, I think. Oh, great. It sounds like we have Yep. We did. We did. Okay. Let's put a block down here and take that out. There we go. Now I almost want to move this over but then that kills a symmetry but we are going to fill this in with uh, gravel and junk. I am um, I don't like that gap being there. Let's see if we can find some gravel. Do I have any at all? Doesn't... Oh, I got 27. So let's throw in a couple of stacks of cobble to fill that up. There 
and we do not need these stairs going down here which means we can recycle reduce reuse and recycle and that's how it goes and then we're gonna fill this up with as much gravel as we can now what I might do is uh, use some cracked brick and stuff like that to fill in the rest here instead of having it all just gravel I don't want that let's see here let's put two slabs like that because then we can come up like this and we'll be up here and then we can put like a, a cobble brick or something like that cobble wall there that should be fine and let's put a torch there then one two three four five six two three four five six yeah there we go and that should light things up nicely and we will put one directly across right there and that should be good to go for our lighting situation all right I think the plan is pretty clear um, why did I oh, I got the cobble to fill up certain areas and uh, I meant to get some spruce wood but I am a doofus and completely missed it Whoop. right here yeah there we go spruce wood slab spruce wood we'll just take it all and we'll take the chest as well why not uh, there. and then in you go this like I said is going to be the oak not the oak the uh, the floor that we put all of our spruce wood on and it has to be at the normal level for floor so let's get it put in and uh, I think we're gonna have to put in full blocks right there so let's put a full block just like that and this and we're gonna have to put put them in right here as well and then of course we can use slab but we'll see how it looks if I like the tray effect or not um, also we need to ensure yeah we can just go ahead and put full oak all the way around not full oak full uh, we have to see here oh yeah we can do a full floor all the way up to about here so we can put something there, but let's just leave that clear of anything. And look at this. I think I want to use the slab for something else. Like for under places you can't see. And we're going to use slab all the way in here. I mean, we could use stairs or something, but... I think we're just going to use the regular um, blocks here. And that should work great for what we need it to do. It gets dark down here, so we're going to ensure that the pillar has a torch on it. I didn't know if that was another pigment or if it was my stomach. And there we go. So what to do about this? This is just straight slab. We can get rid of this all the way to here. And I say all the way to here. But that gets in the way. How annoying. We do that. And that, do I like that? Well, actually, that looks pretty nice. Um, makes it look like a doorway, but I don't want that, really. I want to bring this stair the same way. So let's get the stair down here like that. And get rid of this. We will put some oak stairs here. 
like so and so. Do I like that? Let's just do this. I think that's okay. We can make it. Yeah, this is this is where I get so indecisive. So if we do this. And then we have to make sure that our slabs, just do one, two, three, four, yeah, 24 should be fine. The slabs be okay. If we have them right there, they get in the way. So there we go. And we come up here and we can start placing in chests. So. I would put a chest here and another chest right there. Let's just make a bunch, shall we? And then one more for growing spurts. Alright, and there's really not much room to reach back there for any hidden stuff, so I think that's alright. And then what we're going to do is one, and we'll do it this way. There we go. And then we can put another one up there, and we can put a line right here, but this is a good start. So we can look in here and start putting in our woods. I would like one for each type of wood. So we're going to have uh, spruce and oak and so on and so forth. The only other thing I could see is putting these guys der, der, this way and we just are able to walk over and get access to it and then that way we can just come down this two lane here and go click 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 as necessary um, with this guy being maybe the hidden one can we, can we reach in there no we can't uh, because this is not turned um, and have to be turned in a weird way. So there we go. Um, <laughs> we're gonna need trap wire hook, trapped chests, or we skip a space. And if we skip the space, we just put a torch like that, and we can skip a space. But what I'm gonna do is at each level, when you see a full three block, you throw up a torch. And I think that should be good for the lighting for that area. And then there should be another one over there. I might rearrange the upstairs so that um, we can get things going all the way up. But this is the general idea and general plan. Um, I should technically remove these four. And we can save space with slab on this because they can't be seen yep and then there you go we can also pull out these and ensure that we know that this is indeed the the stair uh, the the wood place we can actually say that this right here is going to be the cobblestone or stone area so let's take a look at what we've done here this is a full cobblestone we want full cobblestone block uh, for just about everything here so we want to go this way and that just like so and ensure that our cobblestone is set up all the way around So we'll have to come over here and do this. And we might have to uh, change this here. So how did we handle that down there? We put in slabs on the bottom part. So cobblestone slabs, that would mean that we have a slab right there. I think just putting a simple slab there, maybe even doing this is perfectly fine because then we hide all that and this looks like it's um, 
part of the structure. Yeah, we got a spider out there tracking us. Blech. So we come up here and we almost have this taken care of. I think we have a really good flooring situation because we can just do this all the way over to here and be all right. Yeah, that's that's definitely going to be in the way. Now let's take a look at how we did it with this. It just went all the way back and that's what we'll do here as well. So it goes all the way back. We have our storage. I'm going to throw a torch right there just to lighten it up and make sure that this torch and this torch are on the same level as the floor we're on. Yep, just like that. And this guy's going to go there. Yep. Oh, where did that torch go? I don't know. I don't know. Well, this is pretty much what we're going to do. We're going to set up our storage, quote-unquote, silo. We're going to set up a different slab here. I don't know what slab we're going to do. I'll have to take a look. But then we can get up here and hooray. We are at the top of the tower. We've got skeletons. We've got creepers. Let's see what's over here. We've got a creeper over there. And I'm wondering where that spider sound is coming from. Well, it's coming from somewhere. I have no arrows. So, oh, and there's an enderman. Uh, we don't want to look at him. Let's go ahead and make these guys have a bad day by heading on over to the house as quickly as we can. Sword out. And sleep through the night. Ahaha. Or take a early morning nap. Oh. So we are actually getting closer and closer. Um, I, My plan is really to get the uh, hostile mob farm going. So that we can get some hostile mobs uh, farmed for their resources. And when I say uh, um, farmed and resources, I mean for like string and arrows and stuff like that. The zombie flesh can go away. I don't really care about zombie flesh. I don't want zombie flesh. And I'm not seeing any um, witches, so we're, we're, we're okay here. Uh, cows are looking a little scared. I think they saw me coming and knew I was going to do something. Um, we have to finish up a couple of other projects. Uh, one of them being um, whatchamacallit, the, uh, the smeltery. Though I think uh, we have four here. We have eight actually. Uh, I think this smeltery system over here is just fine. And we can use this one here, um, reuse the hoppers for something. So I think that's probably going to be a, a better deal. And we can maybe use these hoppers to uh, feed these guys in. So we'll have to take a look at a system that does that. And that's going to take a bit too because <clears throat> the way this is set up, it is not really conducive to putting uh, fuel into these guys. And uh, hiding everything and all that is not all that easy. So we're going to probably decommission that side. Uh, maybe use this for ingot storage. I don't know. We'll find out. And uh, ore storage. Because we've got some ore here. we got a bunch of other stuff. Um, let's see here. We have spruce. We have birch. We've got acacia, oak, and dark oak. We're missing jungle tree. So I need to find a jungle biome as well. That's whoop, one thing we have to do as well. So, until next time, enjoy playing Minecraft. Yes, my outro is changing a little bit because I'm trying to make it less verbose. So enjoy playing Minecraft. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps me know what you guys are looking for and uh, what you guys want to see. And if you could visit patreon.com slash ExcaliburZone, that would help me out even more. As always, it's Excalibur, and I am out.